we chose to do is 6x squared plus 11x plus 4. So this is our trinomial. So the method that we're going to use to solve it is called crisscross factoring. So first what you're going to do is make your crisscross. So you're going to make a big x, and you're going to make little arrows here. These are just to help us. So first what we want to do is get to 6x squared through multiplication. So what we're going to do, there are, so we're going to factor it out. So it could be either 2x times 3x or x times 6x. So we're going to start with 2x and 3x. So we're going to put our 2x up here and our 3x down here. Okay, that's what we're going to do is we're going to factor out the 4 because we wanted to multiply to give us 11x. So the factors of 4 are 2 and 2 and 1 and 4. So we're going to start with 2 and 2 because part of this method is just guess and check. So we're going to put a 2 up here and a 2 up here. So then what we're going to do is using our arrows, we're going to multiply. So 2x times 2 gives us 4x and 3x times 2 gives us 6x. And then since we're using addition here, we're going to add them together, 6x plus 4x, which gives us 10x. But 10x obviously does not equal 11x. So we're going to try different method. We're going to try and use different numbers. So instead of using 2 and 2 like last time, we're going to use 1 and 4. So we're going to have 2x times 4, which gives us 8x, and 3x times 1, which gives us 3x. We're going to add these together, and this gives us 11x. So we got it. So our final step now is to write our, our final equation and check our answer to see if we indeed got the um, original equation. So what we're going to do is we're going to add these across to get 2x plus 1 multiplied by 3x plus 4. Now we're just going to FOIL to see if we got the right answer. So 2x times 3x is 6x squared. Then 2x times 4 is 8x. 1x times 3x is 3x. And 1 times 4 is 4. We just combine like terms now to get 6x squared plus 11x plus 4. And we got our original equation.